Ah, Norman Jaden. Naaman. FBI extraordinaire. Now, there is a fourth character. I am surprised. I thought we were going to see them at, before this, but I am shocked that we haven't yet. So we got Ethan Mars, bad, sad dad with no kids. We got Detective Shelby, or uh, Scott Shelby. He's his, you know, P.I., private dick. And then we got Nam and Jaden, FBI. Do you think it's, gonna it's gonna take, take long? long? I'm impatient. No, he should be finished soon. I got the shaky legs. Time to put on my glasses. Oh, Mo, you may not have lost Sean, but at least you have your house. <laughs> oh, that's right. If nothing else, I have my house. Oh. Just, you know, the little things in life make me so happy. <gasps> Time for VR ball games. So only I can see this. Meaning, anybody who turns to look at me is gonna think I'm nuts. Like, what is he doing? Yeah, exactly! I'm <laughs> like, what the hell? It's like, this is what the FBI accepts now? Wait, can I not play another game? Also, each hit is one point. He has been playing this game for far too long. Like, he's racked up a tally of 21, 112? Damn, Norman, how bored are you? Let's put those off. Uh, let's see. Oh, man, I wish AR glasses were a thing. I know! Give me my future goggles. They already lied to me about the hoverboard. They told me 2015 I was going to have a hoverboard, and they lied. Alright. I got the jimmy legs. I got the shaky legs. I can't sit still. Oh, here we go. I'm off, Charlene. I'll look at the reports later. I'll cancel all appointments for this afternoon. Okay, but oh, Captain, but I'm your appointment. Norman Jaden from the FBI is here. It's like ah, shit. <laughs> Jaden, of course, we've been expecting you. Yeah, you've been expecting my appointment, which you're canceling in front of my face. Walk. Yeah, of course. Oh, the good old walk I and talk. I wanted to introduce myself before getting started. Oh, I actually have to walk. Uh, perhaps there's a better no, time. No, no, now it's fine. And there's Blake. There's desk. We have them every day now. Believe me, it's not always easy. Are police coming, stations so. this like open? Today we have some new. I've never been in a police station, which have you met? Have you know, met? I guess wait, a little yeah. mirror. Wait, yeah, dude, get before. out of my way! <laughs> oh my goodness. Hey, Jaden, are you? I'm coming. I got sidetracked. Blake, yeah. I have. Yeah, we met this morning. He's an asshole, but we're gonna find that out soon enough. He has his own methods, but he's a good cop. I'm sure you'll get Is him. He? Well together. You All know right, we're gonna do good cop, bad cop. Next time. I, I do guess. not. I don't not no, frank, know how to not. I could have done without the FBI on this one, but the press. I could just mess this up. This origami killer case crept up Mega on us. Wins or it's not. Becoming a national concern. You know what? No. There are hundreds gonna fail. of killers in this country, but what do you know? This guy. Let me fail, so David. Guy. He leaves flowers and origami figures. Origami. Origami. Let's get onto it. And we suddenly become the center of the universe. All right, I guess I have to tie I'm this here to arrest time. a serial Whoa, killer. something's going wrong with my head. With respect, sir, the rest of it, it's none of my business. And I say, with all due respect, with having no respect. No. All right, gonna, here we go. Of course not. All I'm Just asking you strangle this man with his own tie. Fast. The press won't perpetrate <laughs> And we're gonna It's 2020, the hell my AR glass? Exactly, Mo. You are right. Hmm. Oh, I did good. Not bad, not good, but not bad. Man doesn't even know oh, how to tie in his own tie. She'll show you to your office. I'll but go see Charlene when I want. If you're interested, it'll give you an idea of the political climate around here. Thank you. Yeah, things aren't sir. good. People don't like it when the cops Welcome don't solve the murders and they have eight dead children. At least, you know, you would think. I saw Blake when I arrived. Maybe I should go talk to him. Lieutenant Cotta Blake. I'm dying of thirst. I'm thirsty. Where's the water cooler when you need one? Ooh, there's a map. Oh god, there's actually a map. A, oh, no, no. Norman. Norman Jaden, come back. Look at this map. 
Ah, Center City. That is Center City. We are in Philadelphia. Good old Philly in Pennsylvania. Jeremy Bowles. Oh. Was found this Hold morning on. on a patch of wasteland in the East End at about Abandoned lot. Five days after he was reported missing. An autopsy will be. So the nice thing about this game is you have the choice of not even going to this at all. Like, I could have just ignored this conference. Oh, my pants are still muddy. State in which the body was found. Oh, consequence. Wait, where am I? The I'm just stuck. Okay, there we go. Oh, Mo, you, you live in Philly. That's right. I am about maybe 40 minutes away from Philly. I am close. I used to work in Philly. I'll field some questions. Not, you know, kidnapping kids yeah. or anything like that for rain purposes. You said the methodology right, indicated let me sit another on this. victim for the origami killer. Can you be more specific? <laughs> yeah, he can't tie a tie. How do you expect him to solve a murder? He can't, apparently. <laughs> As evident by the eighth body we've just found. Okay, so we're learning more about the MO for this killer. never identified. Perhaps the origami killer will never be found either. Well, I don't know. I don't think I'm on the case now. For the moment, the killer may think he's invulnerable, but in the end... Uh, he'll Artemis, I learned how to tie a tie in high school when you're going through a semi-butch yeah. period. <laughs> As you do, you know. Any written evidence. I have a tie. I tr I knew how to tie it at one point like back in no. high school as well. Yeah, he has not made it was a nightmare before Christmas time. We have only the murders to help us I still have it, but I have forgotten how to tie it though. Yes. Okay, so we've learned the MO, which I probably should have been paying attention, but based off of my memory of playing this game before, basically the origami killer, the bodies that are found have no visible evidence of violence or any kind of like struggle on them. The kids die of drowning. It is true Which is why it's important to note that to that's why we're being shown how many town. inches the of rain we're getting. In these areas makes because the most of the difficult. crimes take place in the fall during the rainy time season. So it's like a kid goes missing, yes. then you only got a certain amount of there time to find them before the they drown based on the rain. The is that oh, true? that's me. They're talking about me. I'm from the FBI. Yes, we asked the FBI yeah. to send us a profiler to help us. I will take all questions. We Starting with you over there. In the next few days, but it seems that I'll sit back down again, though. According to so yeah, the kidnapper the takes a kid, puts him somewhere, drowns him in rainwater, then leaves their body to be found arrested. on like a wasteland or open Pure abandoned lot with an no orchid and a origami figure in their hand. Except to support the so so far we've lost people. eight kids. Let's make it an even dozen. We got four more to go. It's fine. One question, please, sir. One last question. Captain Perry, no more questions. Question, please. All right. So I could have just ignored that entire like conference. Ooh, I want vend I want some candy. Give me candy. Cases all right. So that was the press. In all the papers. It's not going to be easy investigating. So yeah, I could have gone and talked to was it Candace, Charlene, secretary lady. I gotta talk to her right away and just ignore that whole press conference, but that gives you I more information the about the killer. Stretch my legs for a bit. Uh, I should get Perry's assistant to in my office. I can't wait to get to Perry's work. assistant. This investigation is starting to give me the creeps. I'm hooked on a feeling. Get a hold of yourself, man. Get a hold of yourself, Naman. The FBI. You can do this. Can I just leave? <laughs> can I just leave? No! David Cage's invisible wall prevents me from leaving. Heading back to Washington. <laughs> Getting out of here. Oh, there's two levels. Oh, I can't use this. No elevator for me. <laughs> no elevator for me. I didn't realize that was a wall. I thought it was like a pillar. Hold on, wait, stop walking in place there. Hello, fellow cops. Strange character, Captain Perry. How are you Seems doing, fellow policemen? <gasps> Drink! Give me, give me coffee, or give me death. Speaking of which, I'm gonna take a sip. Well, it's not a Keurig, but it's close. Take up this piping hot coffee. Ah, oh, it's crap. Gross. Throw it away. It's wasteful. All right, is there anything else? Can I talk? No. Hello, ma'am. <gasps> Snacks. All right, I gotta... Can I talk to Blake? 
Can I talk to Blake? My nom and Jaden. Boston accent. I'm ready to How's the investigation start. going, dude? Maybe we should kick off by talking about the case. I'm gonna share some notes. I have some work to finish here. Let's talk about that later, if you don't mind. Oh, but I do okay. mind. Uh, no problem. Aww. Just let me know when you're available. We'll go get lunch. Aww. Ooh, I get to look in on who's arrested. Very tiny c God, these are tiny cells. Hey, dude. What are you doing? Don't graffiti on the wall. I'll charge you for it. Who's in there? Ah, it's the drunk tank. Hello, sir. Who's in here? Oh, they're just watching this dude? Alright, observation. Mo, he hated the coffee so much he had to shout. Jason! It's like I kill for a good cup of coffee. Ooh, interrogation room. Where is he? Where's Scarecrow? Ooh. Time to watch brutality at its finest. You can't touch him, cop. Let him go. You're not supposed to touch them. It's like, I swear, officer. I swear. I only had 50 bucks. So we're just walking around the office a little bit. Just investigating. So I do like the fact that my clothes still have mud on them. Like, if I didn't fall down that hill, if I successfully navigated that without taking any, I guess, damage, per se, my my attire and suit would be squeaky clean. Oh, I shouldn't be in here. Sorry. Okay, time to keep going. But I only have the one suit. Oh, do I have the one suit? Surely I would have come to this city with more than one suit. Alright, I'm not gonna talk to Charlene. I'm not gonna advance the plot because I want to explore. Can I look in here? Alright. This is the meeting room. Pow wow here. Alright, excuse me, ma'am. Need to take a look. Ooh, restroom. See, like I said, for some reason, with every character, you can use the bathroom. This is so weird. I shouldn't be in here. It is the men's room. Oh god. They don't know. Haha, -ha, I'm in the man's room. Look at my pretty face. Oh god, I'm getting Connor flashbacks. I'm looking at myself. Look at me, I'm so pretty. With my with my muddy pants. Can I go to the bathroom? Ooh. Um, now, I don't need to go into the handicap stall, but it's roomier. Oh, someone's in here. I'm sorry. Pardon me. My mistake. I <laughs> could. No, I don't need to go. I'm fine. I can hold it. No, I don't need to go. I realized in Fahrenheit, another David Cage game, there's also a restroom. Which you start out the game in a restroom. <laughs> Things do not start off well in that game. Okay. Hey, Popo. Can I go in here? No, I can't go in there just yet. I'm gonna go talk to Charlene. Hey, Charlene, how's it going? What about that watch? Nice watch. Can I take it? Oh, it's the present we offer to our new lieutenants. Ooh. We bought the same model each year for the past 20 years for each promotion. Head so Blake should have time. that watch. It's the kind of thing that always goes down well. You can contribute to our fund if you like. We're still a few dollars short. No. I'm the FBI. No. Sorry, I I don't have any change. No problem. Maybe next time. I have 50 around. bucks. So you have 50 bucks? Can I have Barry my office now? You could show me to my office? Yes, of course. My um, office? Where I can do crime? I mean, solve crime? Take the watch. She walked away, Jaden. Take the watch. It's free watches. It's free. Agent Jaden, are you coming? I'm going, woman. I was trying to take the watch. David Cage wouldn't let me. Oh, this is not an office. This is a pie closet. Look at it. They put me in a box. This? This is my office? Look at those pictures of developers. That's I was told to take you. Ugh. If you need anything, you know where to find me. I do. Bye, Charlene. I'm disappointed. 
All right, time to sleep. Sleep on the company dime. Okay. Time to work. Time to do nothing. I could sit down, but I'm not gonna. Not yet. I'm gonna look. Look at these wanted posters. Well, apparently I can't. So that's why you should explore the office before going to talk to Charlene, because you're basically stuck in here now. Time to move this desk. Yeah, in a fit of rage, just throw everything off. Oh, now my suit's mu muddy and dusty. Oh, gotta mash, gotta mash. Imagine failing this QTE. Like, I am too weak to move this desk. All right, time to solve crimes. I have to commit crimes and then solve them. It's basically the plot of Fahrenheit. You you create a crime and you solve. Oh no no wrong wrong button. Sit back down, Jaden. Sit down. There we go. All right, let's put on Airy. Airy comment. We play the ball game again. Step one. Change the office. Change my wallpaper. All right, chat, you wanna help me pick out which uh, design? All right, so this is fall. Ooh, a little laggy here, but we're good. So you can help me choose my office, chat. That's, his, yeah, you're right, this is autumn. Smash! Oh, I'm on another planet. Could I possibly be on Mars? Ethan Mars. It's all coming together now. It's foreshadowing. Slam! Now we're in a landscape. Lots of plants. Oh, you like autumn? All right, let's just check this last one. <gasps> Shark! Do, 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 do. Okay. <laughs> See, I don't think I can work in this environment. I would be freaking out like, I can't breathe. All right, let's go for autumn. This one's for you, Mo. Oh, so peaceful. Perfect environment to solve a murder. All right, get get out of here. Get out of here. All right, gotta look at my clues. Now I do have to say this mechanic is very interesting to me. All right, gotta analyze. Analyze these tire tracks. Brain a car. All right, I analyzed it. I got a geo analysis this car. Oh, no data. How unfortunate. Oh, I can't solve the crime. I'm done. I gotta turn in my badge and my gun. No, I'm gonna keep my gun. They can take it from me. <laughs> Ooh, paper. Just the genetic makeup. Not genetic makeup. <laughs> yes, the genetic makeup of this paper. Oh, wait. Gotta geoanalyze this paper. Ooh. What is. Wait. Oh, oh, that was where we found the origami. Okay. I was gonna say, I'm like, wait, what does that, what does that suggest? All right. Gotta analyze this orchid. So this is Norman's whole thing. He finds clues, then uses Aerie to analyze it, to kind of narrow down, like, a list of suspects. So this is where locations of, like, flower shops, where you could find orchids. All right, so I've, I've cleared. All right, get out of here. Get off my desk. Let's look at the files. Take a look at these case files. Toss them up. All right, we got the MO, and we got the victims. Let's look at the MO first. Open that up. Always the same ritual. An origami in the hand, an orchid origami. on the chest. The victims have always been dead for less than six hours when they were found, which means they remained alive for several days before being drowned. So those kids gotta be like exhausted and hungry and starving and thirsty. Well, I mean, suspects interrogated. Maybe not thirsty. 
Not a single lead to go on. Oh, these popo. What are they doing? All right, so I opened that. Let me analyze this. Got nothing. The killer is white, age between 30 and 45. Of course they are. He's intelligent, calm, and determined. An organized type. He has a car. He's probably employed, but his work allows him free time. So he could do, like, freelance. He could be a streamer. <laughs> All right. Oh, there's no data. Hey, Fly, how's it going? Welcome in. Oh, thank you for the host. How you doing? Welcome in to my one year anniversary here on Twitch. We're solving crimes. Poorly. <laughs> <laughs> but how you doing? Hopefully you're enjoying your day so far. Eight victims in the last three years. Oh, jeez. All boys, aged between 9 and 13. The cops are not doing a very good job no at catching the killer. Violence. The victims disappear from public places in broad daylight. No one notices anything. Oh, no, Ethan's boy. Bodies are found three to five days later. Drowned. In rainwater. It's a good thing I'm on the case. Nom and Jaden, FB. Oh, wait, no, I already analyzed it. No, back out. Wait, did I not analyze this? No, I didn't analyze line it. Adjacent to where the bodies are found. And all the victims disappeared in the fall. When the rain is heaviest. You could say it's heavy rain. Oh, Fly, how, I'm well, how are you? I'm doing well, thank you. Yeah, I can't believe it's, oh, look at all those kids. Oof. They even had little pictures and everything. Yeah, I can't believe, like, it's already been a year. All right, so get off my desk, get out of here. I could. Let me look at the map. So this is all the evidence I've had so far. This is a broad area. I've narrowed it down. I'm so close. Oh, you got back from vacation. Oh, nice. So you're eh. Where'd you go for vacation? You go out of state? Do you take a staycation? All right, well, I've already looked at the clues. I've looked at the files. I like this environment, so we're gonna close Airy. So just like the other two, this is his gimmick. So like Ethan had his blackouts, Shelby had his asthma, Nam and Jaden has his shakes, his withdrawal. Here we go again. I gotta go wash my face. I gotta go splash some water on my face. Oh, look at those prompts. They're shaking. I need to take some. I'm gonna faint. If I'm, I'm gonna resist. faint. Oh, jeez. Yeah, no Sorry. one's gonna notice this as I, I walk make, out I in know. a whole crowded no, police it. station. This Here is we go normal. Again. I better go wash my face. Let me go wash my face. Where's the prompt for the door? Where's the... Let me out. There we go. I'm like, I'm here. Let me out. No. Oh, how'd that... Wait. I could take Trypto, the drug. But I'm gonna exit. I'm gonna go splash water in my face. It's like... That vial just appeared out of thin air. Is everything alright? I'm fine. I'm cool. I don't have drugs. I arrest myself. No I plant drugs that. on my own body. Oh, I got the shakes. Oh no, this is not good. I gotta hold my hand. I'm gonna walk myself to the bathroom and hold my own hand. So no one will see my shaking hand. See, this is where multiple button holding prompts come in handy. Oh, you want to, uh... I'm, I'm trying to remember what state is Missouri? Oh, splish splash. Time to wash my face. I like this transition though. This is a really cool visual transition. Oh, you went to visit your girlfriend her birthday. Oh, nice. Oh, my Discord link doesn't work? Oh no, I'll have to check it. Thanks for the heads up. I thought it worked. Oh, is it, is it, are you using the Discord link that's on my page, or the link that's used, that Nightbot's using? I'll have to double check. I'll check both. Oh wait, there's Ethan, there's me. Oh 
don't know. I'm being interrogated. This is Lieutenant Blake, Mr. Marsh. I know. Well, Ethan happened. doesn't, but... It, it was this afternoon. I lost the my only son now. My son, Sean. I'm a horrible we dad. For a while, and then he wanted to go on the carousel, so I put him on one of the wooden horses. What I call a merry-go-round. But apparently it's a carousel. Sean had disappeared. Exactly. I'm not what telling him I blacked out. Park. Try to remember exactly, Mr. Mars. Every detail. So this is where the important. game's trying to make sure that you were it paying attention. About... It was 4:10. But I could lie to these cops. Oh, 4:15. 4 4:15. No, it's 4:10. I remember exactly because I looked at the clock in the park when we arrived. What was your son wearing when he disappeared? Ah, uh, there's Norm and Jaden. There I am. Oh, what color was his coat? It's beige. A beige coat. It was like white. And a pair of pants. Close enough. He had no pants. Oh god. Um Brown? Brown. Brown pants. I guess. Yes. How could Sean have disappeared yes. without you even noticing? Weren't you? I'm right a horrible by the father. My first son died. Um I took a little walk. I went for a short walk around the park. A <laughs> little walk minutes. turned into a giant walk to a back, different street. The they don't stopped, need to know that. And Sean wasn't there. Oh, thank you, you Mo. Yeah, yeah, I'll have to check. I'll have to uh, check and change Nightbot. But thank you. Why did it take you so long to contact the police? But yeah, I. Oh, I pan. I, I searched. I searched. I searched the whole neighborhood. For I don't trust the I cops. I couldn't have gone far. Did I don't Sean trust have any the popo. Difficulties, Mr. Mars. No, he's fine. Something that might have caused him to run away? Oh, I, I did kill my first son, but no, he's fine. Sean is a sensitive child. He Our sees dead people. A he's a medium. Difficult recently. Everything okay at school? I'm horrible dad. Any particular problems between you and your wife? You leave her out of this. We're divorced. Uh, yeah. Uh, Let me be honest with these cops. My wife and I have been separated for the last six months. Ugh. But Sean would not. Have okay, so I guess we're not technically divorced, divorced, but we're separated because of all right. the troubles. That's all the questions I have for now. You're free to go, Mr. Mars. <laughs> we'll continue to look for Sean overnight. Oh, we'll squishy owls! You if we have any more questions? Squishy owls. Do, do you think the origami killer? Of course he did. Took my kid. Listen, your son's probably just run off, and he'll turn up in a couple. I hope he's run off. But what if it is the origami killer? Then he's dead. Well, then we have about four days to find him alive. Jesus, that's reassuring. Thanks, Blake. All right, bye, Jaden. Bye, other me. So the interesting thing there is that... Oh, <laughs> oh my God, I break the news to Did my wife. <laughs> no. No, nothing yet, but they're going to keep looking through no. the night. No, they, they just think my son they, ran off. Do they think it's the origami killer? No, they're being very flippant. It, it, it's still too early to say. They didn't say that. But it is a possibility. Let me just give her worries. You gotta, you gotta really How feel for the wife here. I mean... How could you lose Sean like that? You should never have well, taken I your eyes off Well, I lost Jason him. earlier. Hey, for God's sake, how hard is it to keep your eye on a child in the park? Apparently very Why hard. Why did you leave him, Ethan? Why? I had How the blackouts. Losing Jason? Jeez. No, I had to lose both sons. There can be only one, Mars. No, that's fine. You're fine. Like, you gotta really feel for the wife. Like, not only did she see her one son get hit by a car due to the negligence of the father, but, like, it was his turn to watch the other son, and he lost him. <laughs> like, you'd think if you lose one son, you're just, like, like handcuffing the other kid to your wrist 24-7. Like, no. You're my last one. <laughs> well, time to start making another one. This is fine.